In a blunt response, McDonald Matabe, the former national organizer for the MK party, has refuted advocate Dalim Bofu's claims that he played a significant role in the party's founding alongside former President Jacob Zuma. Speaking on Radio 702, Matabe accused Bofu of dishonesty, insisting that Zuma never intended to involve Bofu in the formation process. Mbofu recently claimed that he and Zuma had initiated discussions about creating the MK party shortly after the ANC's 2022 conference. Describing a lengthy private dialogue that spanned nearly a year, there was a period when only Zuma and I knew about the MK party project because we discussed it after the 2022 ANC conference, Mbofu said, suggesting that the formation was a secret plan known only to them. The MK party launched in December 2023, however, it was not a project when Bofu's involvement was welcomed, according to Matabe. Matabe insists Zuma had serious concerns about including Bofu due to his high-ranking role in the EFF, an association Matabe believes could alienate potential supporters of the MK party. Bofu is lying, Matabe declared. Zuma never wanted him to be part of this. Matabe further elaborated that Duduzi Lezuma and Bofu, along with other EFF aligned figures, were pressuring Zuma to endorse the EFF, an alignment Matabe vehemently opposed. He revealed that the tension behind the scenes, emphasizing that joining forces with the EFF would be detrimental. If people want the EFF, they would have voted for it, Matabe explained, arguing that an alliance with the EFF would harm the MK party's appeal. Beyond that, Matabe disclosed that Zuma had doubts about Mbofu's commitment to the MK party's mission, especially considering Mbofu's dual role as both his attorney and a prominent EFF leader. Zuma was concerned that Mbofu, who was handling his case, was also an EFF member, Matabe noted, indicating a potential conflict of interest. For Matabe, the MK party represents a critical response to the ANC's shortcomings, aiming to correct what he sees as the betrayal of core ANC values by its current leaders. We're making these changes now to eventually bring about the corrections we want, with the hope of returning to the ANC one day, Matabe stated. Matabe also emphasized the importance of collaborations with other left-wing groups to strengthen the MK party's position. He recounted how we advised Mbovo to engage other left-leaning party leaders, saying, Based on our goals for the MK party, I told Mbovo we need to meet with all lefties parties to form a group and then bring Zuma into the discussions to give an overview of our direction.